everybody, it's been about two weeks since my last upload, which was the 12 Days of Nerfus video, and I'm about three weeks behind on my email, so we're going to get back to that soon, I'm going to try to get back to all you guys in a few days. But as you see, this is a very, very special video, and that is a video going to be on the modified Mattel Maximizer. Now, for those of you that do not know, the Maximizer is an extremely rare blaster. There's probably only about ten of them in our community right now, and there's probably quite a bit less than that actually functioning. Uh... I'm very lucky I traded my modified SM5K, which you can find the video here, and uh, I got this. And this one was in kind of a condition when I got it. It had a different front end. Um, as you see, the front end on this one is replaced because uh, the original one is pretty breakable in the spring. And this is just crazy strong, as you can see in there. Now, what happened was that broke. The guy before me, who, who was actually corned, uh, it snapped and he replaced it. So that's what we ended up with. Now mine is still a little bit broken as you see. The black bar in here, which is very, very prone to breakage due to the probably 40 or 50 pound load spring in here. See how it's able to move? That shouldn't be able to move. And what happens is to be able to fire it, I have to hold this down. But um, I'm having Rover Man has me on a parts waiting list because I'm going to get a new part made out of aluminum for that. But um, as you guys can see, I, mean, I got to hold this down while I shoot it. Seal is very, very good, um, and that's just with the stock plunger head on it, and uh, I replaced the entire fore end with some clear PVC, a bushing, and a quarter 20 threaded, tapped, and sealed bolt, and overall I'm pretty happy with it. It was a pain to get the back end off, and uh, there's a couple other things that I want to show you guys. I'm going to specifically put up the internals right now so you guys can get an idea of how it works. Um, this is obviously a lever action blaster, as you see here, which makes priming the ridiculous spring load in here much easier. Uh, it's pretty hard to get into because you've got to get this back cap off and you got to get the front ring off. My front ring actually cracked so I just have a piece of tape holding it together right now. Uh, other than that I opened it up, cleaned it and put a new front end on it and it's shooting well over 100 feet it seems like. And uh, let's go ahead and cut to an internal shot and then we'll go straight to an outdoor firing test. So as you guys can see, I really, really like this blaster, and I've been using a 16-inch CPVC breech on it. That's because my barrel fit in my hopper is kind of weird right now, and I've been using an 8-dart hopper, so this doesn't have quite the volume of a pump snap, and it was doing about 85 or so, but uh, when, when it warms up a little bit, and maybe when I get a nice day to shoot, I'll show it with a hopper. Who knows? But uh, I'm pretty con content to just use it singled right now. It's a very fun blaster to use. I love the lever action. Don't quite love that I have to hold it down for now, but you know, what can you do when you got a broken part? But um, overall, guys, very cool blaster. Um, I've been working on other stuff too, and I've been posting on my Facebook page every couple days if I can. If I'll throw some pictures up actually at the end of this video of what I've finished in the last two and a half weeks of no contact. Uh, I'll try to get back to all you guys who have sent me emails in the last three weeks or so as soon as I can. I'll probably work on it for a couple days here. I probably got close to 150 emails to get back to. Some of them stupid, some of them not. <laughs> this has been a pretty fun video to make, guys. I like always shooting outside, showing you guys how it's going. But uh, like I said, like the Facebook page. I also just hit 3,000 subscribers, guys, and I really, really appreciate all of you, and I hope you guys all enjoy the videos. Uh, now, what that means is they're going to be a giveaway very, very soon. Um, I've pretty much got it in my head about what I'm going to give away, but it's got to be modded first, so... I guess we'll see. It'll probably be in a couple weeks, but, you know, I hope you guys really like it. And, like always, guys, I hope you guys have a nice day, and I will talk to you later. I'll throw some pics up in the end of this video, and see ya. Music